guys, with this kitchen, like I said in my previous video, we will teach you about how to make the pizza sauce. So right now, we have the ingredients in front of us. So we will uh, name it one by one. This is the tomato, tomato peel. So you see, the, I show you. The, this is uh, without skin, this tomato. So it's peeled. And you need the salt. And you need the oregano. This is the one like I talking in my previous video, the Italian herbs. So these are the Italian herbs. And the basil leaves. And you have the capers. So maybe you will ask me if how about if not available those uh, herbs or ingredients in the Philippines. So for example, these capers is not available and it's uh, costly. So you can remove it, it's optional. So you can, uh, you can make it. So here, what you will do only of this tomato, for example, this one is one point. Check how many grams this one, one can? <laughs> huh? Two and a half kilo, okay? So, two and a half kilo, if you will make pizza sauce with this. What you will uh, need to do only on this one is to uh, smash to make it soft or smooth texture. And you will uh, you will put for example this one you will put uh, the salt uh, around 20 grams or 2.5 kilo and for this one you put uh, 15 grams for the oregano juice and for the basin you can put also the same quantity of the oregano so 15 or 20 grams and this one you can put 30 to 35 grams the okay, first so when you put, put all together and also I forget so this one the basil uh, the rosemary leaves. So it's good also to put in the in the pizza sauce. So if you if you ask me if these ingredients are not available, so guys just use tomato sauce <laughs> and salt. <laughs> and then what you will do this one if you don't have the machine, the hand mixer. You can use the any strainer, uh, fine strainer, and you can smash it. So it's good also to use for, for the pizza, uh, that kind of texture of the tomato sauce. So this is the pizza sauce already guys, yeah, like I said here because we already mix it and I show you in the, in the beginning the ingredients that we put all together here, you just only use by the mixer or like I said if you don't have the mixer, the hand mixer you can use only by the strainer and you can uh, smash it by your hand okay guys here we will make now the pizza dough and what we have here is uh, the all-purpose flour this is one kilo and we will put uh, okay let me explain first because we will make only one kilo and then we will uh, put uh, five grams of yeast Okay, so one gram of mushroom. Okay. And uh, salt, we will put uh, for one kilo is 20 grams. Okay. And the sugar, so it's like 2 is to 4. So you, we will put 40 grams of sugar because we don't need too much sweet on the dough. Okay. Okay guys, this one just uh, mix it until all the dry ingredients are incorporated. And we will add the uh, olive oil and the oil and the water. So because we will mixing uh, a small quantity, it's only one kilo to show you how 
uh, you will do it the pizza dough without using the machine so I show you how to mix it by hand only this one and what we will need here water I use only tap water around 560 It's okay. Right. So, the scale not giving me, but uh, 560, 580, it's okay, guys. And 40 gram of oil. Olive oil. So, here, then closer to the machine. Guys, I'm not using gloves because I'm holding the door. But if you are using gloves like this, you have to use it on the top. <laughs> Guys, the dough you need to make it uh, fine or you need the, the texture when it's almost well done, it's clean or they are shiny. So you have to play more, need the dough more if uh, the dough needed to need more because they are still sticky. So you need to uh, to knead the dough very strong like this. See, it's still sticky. This do now it's almost ready. Wow, it's time to um, to knead the dough. Anyway, this now uh, almost ready. And you see now when you do it, it's clean. So we. What do you do this one? You will see also when you make paratha. Okay, this is uh, done. And what you need to do only is to rest the dough. And it's because this one you can use it after after two hours. And it will uh, move the dough and you can use it. Because we use the tap water, meaning it's not hot. Because if you are mixing a huge quantity of uh, pizza dough, like 10 kilo, you need to mix with the uh, ice so you need the uh, the water is good so but this one it's tap water so after two hours you can use the dough okay guys thank you okay guys so this is the do now it's ready and you can use it and like in my previous video in uh, making the pizza margarita so this is the dough right now for that and any flavor of pizza later on we can show you and you can follow us so don't forget to subscribe and like and share our videos for more videos to come and so keep watching us thank you bye